Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Star Flames. In this video, we're going to talk about what is Kim cooking up? Because honey, I smell something cooking and you know, psych word, when she cooks up something, you know that she's going to have the internet talking or she's going to come out with some, you know, product declaring that it's doing magic for her. But this product will not do magic for everyone else, right? No, not saying that everything she does is like, you know, a money grabber. But Kim really barely ever speaks the truth. And this time around, I do believe that Kim is lying again and she's plotting something. But I could be wrong. But I want you guys to let me know if, do you smell something cooking as well? Let's talk about it, right? Because we know this girl is definitely something else. Now, I'm not accusing Kim of any insurance fraud because that's a huge crime to be accusing someone of, right? But something is just not, you know, going together based on what Kim is saying. So... If you remember, last week I said to you guys, I came across an article which indicated that Kim is returning after suffering an injury. And I said, wait a minute, what kind of injury did this girl suffer? Because we haven't seen any sight of an injury. She didn't look like she was sick. She was there in Italy at that Dolce & Gabbana show where she pulled out her purple comforter she was looking stunning, but looked like she pulled out that purple, purple comforter that people said she stole Taylor Swift album cover look, right? So she was there in Italy. Um, she has been pretty active. We're not seeing, well, I'm not seeing where Kim took a six-week break. I am not seeing any point in time when Kim's shoulder was in a sling because when she came back to Instagram, this article was August 7th. So Kim came back to Instagram on August, well, according to her, according to her, right? She came back to Instagram on August 6th. And she was there with her fitness instructor in an Instagram story. You know, she said, I broke my shoulder and tore the tendon. So I've been out the gym a few weeks. But I'm back, right? That's what she said in that Instagram story and her fitness, you know, um, trainer, her personal trainer is there to help her with her rehabilitation. So you could see her trainer standing beside her, right? And then Kim, you know, Kim is going to dress up for everything. Then she walked over to that Barbie drink that she has been promoting that no one wants and that was it. So I don't know what she is doing because think about it. If she broke her shoulder, it takes about six weeks, anywhere between four to six weeks for a broken shoulder to be healed. Not completely, but where you can go back and start the rehabilitation process of, you know, getting your shoulder in working motion and doing particular exercises to help with that broken shoulder, right? No, not just that. What Kim said is really eye-catching because she said that the broken shoulder came from an injury of some sort. Nothing is clear. So is it that this is regarding an insurance? Is it that it's regarding her promoting her drink? Because the manner in which she moved over to, you know, the drink and then, you know, her personal trainer say, I got you, you know, and um, Kim says, I'll be starting rehabbing today, right? Nothing going to keep me down. It's definitely giving red flag. And then she moved over to the Kimid it's it, 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 it's 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 very questionable i hope you guys understand what i'm saying because what i have observed is two things that has been happening with kim 
And this is all allegedly because, hey, honey, we ain't got $4 million, okay? So this is all allegedly, right? Now, if you notice, Kim has been doing what I believe some quiet promotions for companies, allegedly, and then say, hashtag not sponsored. Isn't that kind of red flaggy? And then, you know, she's doing the same thing with her little drink here, and she's talking mm. about suffering a broken shoulder from some type of injury and a tour tendon. Something she's putting in the making. You know, when you're setting the tone for something, that is what I'm sensing here. Because why is it that you're just saying that, hey, something you didn't know about me, I broke my shoulder. We know broken shoulders, they take a little bit of time to heal. And if you go back to Kim Kardashian's Instagram page versus paparazzi sightings, have we seen Kim's shoulder in a sling? No. Has Kim appeared to be sick at any point in time? No. So based on that, it has me questioning her motives. What is Kim Kardashian motive for saying that she broke her shoulder, she tore a tendon, no sign of it. And if you take a look at her Instagram page, and if you look at, you know, all the reports that has been coming out and Kim, you're saying, how the hell did you heal? Where do you get time to heal? Like when? When, okay, let's say she took a minimum of three weeks. When was that three week span? When did you bro break that shoulder? And after breaking that shoulder, like how did you get to do so many things, you know, in the midst of you breaking your shoulder? Enter Miami with Tristan Thompson. Um, you went to Japan. You went to, um, again, Italy, that Dolce & Gabbana show you were there posy posy so at what point was kim's shoulder broken right because she can't say it was a year ago because she came to um instagram with her trainer saying that her rehabilitation starts now right which means that she recently mm -hmm. broke her shoulder and she's good enough to start work out again in order to help her shoulder and that tendon to heal and tighten and all of that. What is the aim here? And this is why I'm saying that something about this, you know, broken shoulder to her tendon story, it is definitely not adding up. It's giving red flag. It's giving, I'm cooking something, but I want to hear from you guys because I know I can't be alone on this. So let's hear what you guys have to say. While you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care and see you all later. Bye, guys.